So here I am with my new old face, younger face, serial killer, as my niece calls me. But anyway, here's the new uh, base from the Charles Lambiazzi Fretless Master Charles Lambiazzi collection. Why do I have it? Because he found it, but I bought it, and, and uh, he's coming to get it. He's going to give me the money for it, of course. But <laughs> anyway, look at this. It's Isn't it beautiful? Now, I'm not sure it looks... I believe that it's it's semi-hollow. And I'm going by knocking on it. It's light. I think if this I think if this were solid it would be really heavy, but it's not. My only complaint about it is it's got lines, it's got fret dots like for every fret. And quite honestly, I'm having a hard time playing this bass. I I prefer just the one on the G, you know, the, 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 as few dots as possible on the neck and no fret lines. I know Charles likes that too. But anyway, let's hear what this thing sounds like. This is, there is a problem also with the, with the bridge pickup. It's not working. I think it's the toggle switch. But anyway, here's the neck pickup. headstock it's like a stand-up bass and it's got two pickups which is optimum for me because why not you have more options you can use this one you can use this one i know charles likes this one and that's why it's not working but he'll make it work he needs this pickup for his sonic explorations so that's it check it out man i like this bass but i have to give it back to charles